Hey everyone, uh, some Disney Toys here, and today I'll be showing you how to make a chocolate Coke bottle that's filled with your favorite candy. The first thing we'll need is a Coke bottle. Next, we'll need something to melt the chocolate in. This one I have here is made out of silicone and it's microwave safe, but you can also just use a bowl. And of course we need the chocolate! Here I have some milk chocolate. And now to pick your favorite candy! I have M&Ms! We'll also need something to cut the plastic with. Alright, now that we have all of our materials, let's go ahead and peel off the label. Be really careful with this because we'll be using it later. Next, we'll dump out the soda. And feel free to enjoy some soda while we're doing this project. Go, 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 go. <sighs> Tasty! Alright, so with the bottle, we just rinse it out and dry it. Time to melt the chocolate! I'll be melting this in the microwave for 30 second intervals. BRB! And I'm back! This is how it'll look after 30 seconds. What's cool about this melting container is that you can mix the chocolate with your hands. Ooh, look at how ooey and gooey this looks. Squish, 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 squish. I love the smell of melting chocolate. But this isn't quite done yet, so back in the microwave it goes. Here's how it looks after another 30 seconds. It's almost done. I think another visit to the microwave should do it. Woohoo! Now it's ready to pour into our bottle. We don't need that much chocolate to coat this bottle. This is about enough. Now we just roll the bottle around till the chocolate completely coats the bottle. While the chocolate is setting, we're going to need to rotate it every now and then so it gets a nice, even layer. Once the bottle is completely covered, we can put it in the refrigerator for a few hours. Now that the chocolate is hardened, we can fill it with M&Ms! You can pretty much pick any candy as long as it fits through the top of the bottle. This bottle is just chocolate on chocolate on chocolate. Ooh, I think I'm getting chocolate wasted. Yum! Okay, now here comes the hard part. We need to carefully cut open this bottle with a knife. I'll first make an incision down here by the middle and work my way up and around the bottle. This part is pretty tough, so you may want to ask an adult for help. Don't want any of my awesome fans getting hurt. I'm trying my best not to damage the chocolate. This is pretty nerve wracking. Woo! 
We made it around! Now let's cut around the bottom part. Yay, we're almost there! I just need to peel off the plastic now. Careful, careful, careful. Whew, I did it! I left some scratches on the chocolate, but don't worry, we can touch it up with a damp paper towel. Little touch up here, little touch up there. Doo -doo 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 -doo. Now to make the bottle look even more realistic, I'll stick back on the label. Oh, and can't forget about the cap. How cool does this look? You could definitely trick your friends with this chocolate bottle. They'll be like, oh, I'm so thirsty. Mmm, here's a bottle of Coke. Huh? It's chocolate. What is this sorcery? And you can surprise them with all the goodies we have inside. I'll use a knife to cut open the bottle. I can't get over how cool this bottle looks. Give this video a big thumbs up if you want me to make more chocolate bottles. And let me know in the comments which sodas you guys want to see. Yum! More chocolate! Chocolate, chocolate, chocolate. I love chocolate. Chocolate, chocolate, chocolate. Woo! Safe to say I think I'm getting a little bit of a sugar high. Well, this was a lot of fun. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Don't forget to subscribe to see more. Thanks! Also, if you haven't done so already, be sure to follow me on Instagram, Facebook, and Twitter. The links are in the description box below.